What's up guys, back with some more raids today. And for the first raid of today's video, we're actually gonna go for something pretty big. Looks like a pretty big clan base here. I'll show you guys right there. You can see all the external TCs he's got set up. We might actually check out that iceberg base afterwards. Looks like it's completely armored. Actually, it's got a compound on the iceberg. So we'll head over there after we raid this thing. Hopefully we don't lose too much on it. I mean, the thing looks pretty short. It's got windows on the first and second floor. Let's head over there and check it out. All right, first of all, I'm looking at these pretty dope skins for the door, man. It's got cash and pigs on it, but yeah, it looks like a sheet metal door. So it looks dope, but it's still going to be only one rocket. And there's actually a furnace running again here and there. Maybe this dude is online, actually. Um, we might just go for this door path on the sheet metal door, see where it leads, get to the core. Look at that. Look how open that is, actually. Yo, there's doors open. Um... Maybe to make sure that we get to where those doors are open, we'll take this embrasure, just 2C4 on there, and we'll head into there. It looks like some of those doors are left open. All right, here we go. We'll send it on this embrasure, 2C4. Go to that door path that's open. And let's see if we can crouch up through here. There we go. So we skipped two doors. Listening for that furnace. I hear it to the left. Looks like we might have to drill through sheet metal does have stone foundation on it if we can somehow make that work but it's too low so we can't squeeze through there yeah i think we'll go straight through sheet metal and looks like this one will for sure get us into that core 4c4 um here we go okay i think we will have to take a sheet metal door we are very close to that furnace that's running. Seems like it's right about here. So let's send a rocket on this sheet door. And we need to take one more sheet metal door to get into that core. Here we go, armored portion. Yo, there's just two armored walls. I feel like you might be giving something away. Could that be where the furnace is? Once this fire goes out, let's listen. Yo, furnace is right here. We are getting comfort. So if we can't find anything in this core for cheap, we're probably going to blast straight into this armored portion. But yeah, 50% comfort. And we'll take this door path leading into the center. Here we go, garage door, armored ceiling. Man, this guy's kind of just giving this square away. Could be some loot in there. We'll take this garage door. Here we go, doors all around. We're gonna send some rockets here, look for TC and anything. Wow, we just destroyed all of these doors and boxes in here, sleeper. Royal clan, anything on the body? Beach chair. All right, he's about to chill. We'll check these boxes. And furnace, ammo, jackhammer, MP5s. Looks definitely picked through in here, like he moved the loot out. He keeps sending rockets to the ceiling's about to break. And there's the armored portion, yeah. Literally the only armored portion that I've seen. Let's go ahead and take down these other two doors. Empty though, there is a door here. We'll see where this door leads. And okay, that could be leading into the armored. Let's try to take that cheat door. Honestly, I'm assuming that's where all this main loot's gonna be. It's just way too obvious. Okay, but it's sealed off. And that's definitely where the furnace is. You guys see that comfort going up? Hard side wall. I'm going straight for this. Okay, there's the furnace. Is this where TC is? No TC, but there's another hard side wall. We'll probably take that. Kind of some hidden loot, other than he left it completely armored, so not very hidden. Unnamed bag and just cooking up metal. Let's check these boxes. Can we get lucky here with some explosives? 
Uh, some tech trash. Looking all right. What about this box? Huh, two rockets. All right, yeah, I think we definitely go for this hard side armored wall. Come on, baby, please be TC. Come on, yes, just a TC. Oh no. So we know there's really not going to be any boxes in here with loot. It's going to all come down to TC if we can get our profit and stuff we used back. Here we go, dudes. Yes, let's go. 72k sulfur uncooked. We'll go ahead and cook that up to base. But yes, definitely pays off. I mean, poor dude tried to seal off his loot. He left the furnace up and running and only completely armored spot on the base. So it's completely obvious to me. But we'll take it, man. 72k sulfur. That's a jackpot for how much we use on this base. Let's go ahead and take this stuff out of here. We won't bother putting doors up because, yeah, we're going to be right up out of here quickly. We saw basically everything. Take some more ladders. Get out of here and I will look for another base to raid. That's a success. Royal Clan coming in clutch with the sulfur. All right, dudes, back with another raid. And for this one, not bringing too much. You guys will see why the base is a bit small. Could be some type of bunker base, but there's something interesting happening on this thing. He's got tons of auto turrets on the top, but they're actually turned off. Hasn't set them up yet. Maybe we can hit him before he sets up the turrets. But the fact that he does have turrets and is setting these up could mean he's rich. I've gotten lucky off of bases with turrets. Looks like it's a main two by one core there. So we just need to get into the core. Possibly find TC and loot. Let's run around this thing, see if there's any doors on it. Okay, there is a sheet. It's a solo. I think this is actually a solo, dude. There's a sheet metal door up here on the top, though. That might not help us out as much. Just need to figure out the cheapest way to get into that two by one. Once again, assuming that's where all the loot's gonna be. Yeah, let's go ahead and take the sheet metal door. We'll see if we can get a good pathway. Maybe end up drilling straight down anyways. Okay, there's even turrets in there. Armored door is left open, but they are going up. That's a shotgun trap too. Two shotgun traps in here. Let's shoot these down and we'll run up through these doors, see where they lead. Wonder if he's got an open path all the way down. That'd be funny. Okay, we're about to get burned up, but let's try to run through this quickly. Oh baby, this is some loot. Oh, we can't get through this. Okay, C4 on this door. Let's see what was in these boxes. This isn't near the core that I was talking about. Yo! What the? There was a guy... There was a guy AFK there, but I just blocked off the bunker. What the heck is this bunker design, dude? That's epic. We are going to have to send rockets now. To destroy that? He was just chilling there. So I guess we send some rockets. I'm not sure how this bunker works. That's some crazy honeycomb in there. We'll send rockets down there. Okay, the sheet metal's broken. Can we get through that? Please tell me we don't have to break armored. Looks like we do though. The floor auto sealed below him. Oh, okay. Never mind. We can get down. Let's go. Fish clan, he, had a, he was about to set up even more turrets, but he doesn't have any power to him. Oh, we still can't get through. Maybe once this thing goes away. Okay, please tell me we can squeeze through. Yeah, let's go, TC, everything. TC's locked, we'll destroy that. What a strange raid and base design. We've got a counter coming in. Need to get a door up. Oh my gosh, all right. Yeah, we're gonna have to defend from counters. Let's see if we can get the sealed as well. There we go. Should be pretty good with that. Counter is coming in right now. Get us completely sealed off down here. And we need to get a TC down actually ASAP. Oh, baby, come on. Let me put a TC. Let's just throw this back and get a TC.
Okay, not the best spot for a TC, but TC is down. This might be tough to defend. Yeah. But let's start checking loot just in case we die. Meds. M2s. Let's go. Three M2s in here. First M2 of the wipe. Actually, from a solo dude. Used up all his tech trash. Looks like we might be expecting some C4 here. No. No C4 yet. Let's check that TC. We're going to pick up the rest of these weapons and pick up this box. Okay, come on, let me loot that DC. Yes, dudes, let's go back to back 70,000 plus sulfur raids. 10,000 gunpowder on that one too from a solo. Not to mention the M2s we're gonna be using for the rest of wipe as long as we can live here. Might just chill in here for a bit, let it cool down. That counter hasn't started doing anything yet. But where's this dude's explosives? I mean, we couldn't check that last box, I think, back here. I think this is where the C4 is gonna be. Let's go for it. Oh, I guess it's locked. Okay, we're gonna have to destroy it. Come on, this has gotta be C4. You guys saw how he used all his tech trash and stuff? The only box we haven't checked right here. Yeah, 52? What? Okay, well I was expecting some C4, but not 50 freaking 2 C4. And now we definitely have to survive this counter. And we have enough, basically, that fuels us for the rest of wipe. We can go search for a massive clan base, maybe hit an armored cave or something if we can find it. But yeah, I am super happy with that raid. Massive jackpot off of a solo as well. We got GLs now we can use to defend from counters. Dude hasn't made any noise outside. Maybe he's realized that I'm in here with TC and sealed it off. Anyways, if he tries to break in, I will show you guys what happens. But for now, I'm going to cut it here and see you guys at the next raid. This wipe is looking bomb so far. All right, dudes. Well, what did I say we were looking for? An armored cave base, and we found one. Now, I'm definitely not bringing all of that C4 that we got from the other base. We still have some stashed away, but just in case anything goes wrong here, just gonna bring 40, which is just a little more than half that we got. Should be enough to do this, unless my dude is an excellent builder and made this thing completely secure. Anyways, it is sealed off with armor. Looks like we're going to be drilling through some armored walls here. Let's hope for some more profit, and without further ado, let's send it. Let's see, yeah, it is armored, but it's squares, so, I mean, not as secure as it can be. Let's keep on going here. We're gonna watch out for loot being stored above. Seems like that's what most people are doing nowadays. So if we don't find anything here on the first floor, we're gonna definitely go upwards. Okay, sheet metal here. Um, gonna go ahead and send eight rockets. We probably should have brought more rockets. We'll send eight rockets, maybe end up blasting out a floor above just to check and maybe go through this or we'll see what's behind the sheet metal. Here we go. Okay, what's behind that sheet metal? Still armored. I don't know if we want to go up just yet. That's a counter. Okay, that counter seems like he just flew away let's try to make this quick i'm gonna go ahead and send off my six rockets we'll use the gl to finish these out but just in case we get lucky here and find loot above i'm gonna keep on sending these rockets okay that's the last rocket gl time there we go we got lucky dudes that's a workbench three that just broke my dudes actually got loot up here and we're on a pathway so we should have enough that's tc oh my god let's go guys no there's hardly anything in there Bro, there better be some loot back here. We just use a solid amount of C4. Anyways, we'll get this sealed off so the counters can't come in. Once again, not looking good. I mean, it looks pretty empty up here. Gonna have to hope for some C4 and rockets in these coffins. Okay, never mind. That's looking good. Two auto turrets. Looks like he's organized the entire box of 556. Five, Weapons. Yeah, this dude's got some stuff in here for sure. Gear sets. Um, ladders? Come on, dude. LRs. Oh, no. Well, I guess we can follow that path. 
pathway now. Either this dude's been cleared out of all of his C4 or there's gonna be some hidden here on the first floor. We'll take this garage door down. No rockets left. We'll use the GL. Okay, looks like we destroyed a box here. Hopefully this is main loot with explosives. Otherwise we're probably gonna have to drill through an armored. And we got rockets, gear sets, meds. Turrets? I mean, a dude this super organized has gotta have some loot. Let's find the cheapest way to get to the way back of the cave. Could be sealed off. Oh my gosh. Bro, half floors? For real? 4C4, let's go. Um, yeah, well, looking like this is all honeycomb. I'm gonna send off the rest. We've got exactly 7C4, we can finish it out with GL, but definitely gonna have to call it after this. Just, it's sketching me out that this isn't hard side. I think this dude might actually just have used all of his C4 or it's some sort of bait base, but we'll send off the rest of our explosives here. Hopefully we get lucky. Come on. Wow. Just the back of the cave. So, I mean, we used basically every single thing I brought and we got all the way to the back. We saw TC. Should have known after we checked that TC that there was no sulfur in it. This dude was broke. I mean, he's so organized, but uh, just no C4 in here. Really sucks that we used all that stuff. Counter is just flying up there above me. Don't know what he's doing, but we've got it sealed off anyway. So I'm going to move on from here. That really sucks. But luckily we got lucky on the first, what, two or three raids of today. So yeah, we'll go ahead and call it there. Maybe we can find one more base to raid. Get some of this stuff back that we used. All right, guys. So I found another base and really quickly, just before we start this raid, wanted to remind you guys, I am playing on the 5X No BPs US server. So just in case you guys want to come on and counter me or get your base featured with a nice build, hop on and I'll see you guys there. But yeah, this is probably going to be the last raid of the video. And this is pretty interesting here. He's got wooded door on an armored doorway here. I'll ladder up and show you guys what's going on. Um, auto turret. Turning on and off. Let's see how long it's going to stay on for. But yeah, anyway, we could probably dodge that. And we'll send two rockets for these sheet doors and then take that wooden door down. Just trying to get lucky here, trying to recoup some of that profit from the cave. I was super stoked about that cave base after we found out he was organized and stuff. But yeah, he didn't have any C4 in there. So we'll go for this base. Last base. Hopefully we can get lucky. This door doesn't even have a freaking lock, bro. Okay. Wooden door is down. Are we going to be able to dodge that turret? Let's wait for that sucker to turn off again. And we'll run past it. Oh. Okay, so there is another wooden door in there. Let's send one rocket past the turret into that wooden door. Turret's off for now. And we got two sheet metal doors, furnaces. Just a bit of metal in there. Oh, the turret's on. Oh my gosh. Once we get into the sheet doors, we should be safe from that turret. It just keeps flipping on and off though. Watching my back for counters on that road. No, no. Okay, well, now we're kind of stuck. Let's take down these doors. All right, we're good from that turret. Maybe it'll protect from counters a little bit. Box is over here. Can't really check them yet until that turret turns off. Looks like this might be TC. Yeah. TC, we're privved. We'll check a door up for that turret. And it looks like maybe just a two man clan. Lord Ace and Kashinai. I can't really pronounce that. Start checking loot. Two rockets, a bit of extra ammo, not expecting too much from this one. Luckily, we didn't use much because he had wooden doors. Anything in the bodies? No. I'm going to save that TC for last, but 59 tech trash in there. Two supply signals. We can call those in. Hopefully, recoup some of the rockets we used. 
And I'm gonna take this door down before we check that TC. We'll save it for last. See if there's anything back here. All right, just bags back here. They have home on them. So this is their main. Check that TC. Can we get sulfur, please? Last space of the video. Bruh. It was a long shot. <laughs> I had to go for it. But yeah, I guess we did get lucky on a bunch of raids today. So it's not too bad failing. Not really failing those last two, just they didn't have any loot. So can I go ahead and end the video there, guys? And I'll be doing raids every day for the foreseeable future. So make sure to get subbed if you guys want to stay up to date with them. And I'll see you guys tomorrow in some more raids. Wish me luck.